The bicycle, a timeless image in Beijing. But as the next Olympic Games gear up, the bike has taken on an unexpected role. Hidden in here is a tiny piece of metal. It's radioactive. It's being used to train Chinese experts about nuclear security to stop radioactive material from being smuggled into the stadium or dispersed in public places. We consider nuclear security as one part of the overall security of the Beijing Olympics and attach great importance to it for the success of the Games. Experts from the International Atomic Energy Agency train security forces to respond to potential attacks. The energy of the explosion will disperse the radioactive material. It's a mock scenario to detect a dirty bomb using specialized radiation detectors. The IAEA has provided us with a lot of information, equipment and technical training. This is of great help to our security efforts. We attach great importance to cooperation with the international community. We want to learn from the experiences of others in handling security for the Olympics. The complexities of radiation are taught. Close cooperation among all players, from customs officials and medics to bomb squads, is essential. And for this it's important that they are prepared to respond to this. They have to work together to know each other, have some procedures, some plans. Last year, the Chinese Atomic Energy Authority and the IAEA signed a cooperation agreement and a joint action plan for the Olympics. Since then, the IAEA has sent experts to China to provide professional training to law enforcement officials. Officers will guard venues around the city, like the iconic bird's nest, where, come August, Olympic athletes will vie for gold. These new skills will be transferred beyond the Games. Nuclear security is a national responsibility, but an act of nuclear terrorism has global consequences. The IAEA helps countries like China address this new reality and protect the public.